All right, so I thought I'd do a video on what's actually going on in the background of Windows. So just like a fresh install, um, no tweaks done, like what's going on in the background? Because, I mean, a lot of people, obviously, they can come in here and look at Task Manager and see things running, but it's like, you know, what are they actually doing? So I just kind of want to go through that and then, um, do some tweaks to show um, that we can get a lot of that stuff down and uh, not cause any issues. All right, so this is just a stock install of uh, 25H2. Um, I think this is like, it's probably like the latest stable build. Um, so yeah, first we'll look at Wireshark, which is like internet traffic. So I'll just go here. I'll apply the DNS filter uh, just because we, we don't really care about all that. So all these domains, um, some are like telemetry, like these. Um, some of it is like is um, assets and stuff. So like if you go to the store, it's going to obviously have a lot of communication um, to display these different things. Um, so yeah, we'll just leave that going for a second. Um, and then process monitor will just kind of show us like all the processes and what they're doing. So um, you can see down here at the bottom, there's a lots of events. Um, so a lot of like registry changes here, opening keys. Um, and you can see the processes. You can see uh, Defender is doing a lot. So that's gonna be, that's gonna be the main thing you're gonna see in here. Um, SVC host is just uh, like a service host. It's just kind of like a, a general parent process for a lot of services. Um, you see uh, edge view doing some stuff. Um, so yeah, a lot of defender stuff. Uh, but you can see just like the magnitude. I mean, what is that? Four million. So I mean, and we've only had this running for like thirty seconds, maybe. So I mean, there's a ton of stuff going on. So we'll close that because it gets pretty laggy. Um, we have a lot of traffic going on. You can see all these Microsoft domains. All these download servers, um, stuff like that. And then we'll look at one more thing. This is just what's changing in the registry. So we'll do okay. So we already have one thing. If we refresh, boom, it's a lot more. So like what's actually going on is just, a lot of things are getting logged. Um, so for example, Windows will log like the last time you opened like the start menu or something like that, or um, it'll log like like you moved, like you full screened uh, File Explorer or something like that. Um, and some of these things are necessary, like if you full screened File Explorer, like the next time you open it, you want it to be full screened, of course. So um, things like that, you know, it's just quality of life, it, it needs to happen. But a lot of these things, like, there's just so much going on that you can get a lot of this stuff down. All right, so now I'll go through a few options in my script and um, we'll check it after each one. And hopefully by the end, we can get it down uh, to pretty much nothing. Uh, obviously that's not completely possible, but um, yeah, we'll see what we can do. So. First, we'll just start with uh, the registry tweaks. 
and we'll see what it's at after a restart. All right, so after that restart, let's open up Wireshark. And not even a single thing, okay. There's one for Edge, of course, because we still have that installed. Yeah, that's, looks like mostly Edge for now. Uh, let's check process monitor. So it looks like we have some activity from Edge. We saw that in Wireshark. Um, we have the search indexer doing some stuff. Um, Windows Defender doing some stuff. So the standard processes. Um, but you can see they're they're very busy. They're doing a lot of things. So one more thing to check. Um, we'll do registry changes view real quick. See what's going on. And it's pretty quiet. As opposed to last time where it was immediately without even opening anything, just going crazy here. Um, so there we have we have some stuff. Um, this is actually pretty interesting. This is um, like the A-B testing where Microsoft tests features. So if you know about like the Vive tool, uh, this is where it changes that stuff. Um, so that's interesting. All right, so after doing the registry tweaks, it uh, gives us a better idea of what kind of things are actually going on. Um, so I'm just going to go through here and do the ones that make the most sense. So obviously we, we want to disable Defender and Telemetry because we saw that going off a lot. So just something to note, if you notice here, um, we get an error when disabling telemetry. Sometimes a process is locking the host file. Um, so yeah, you can either just try running again, you can see no error that time, or you may have to restart and then run it again, but it'll eventually work. So the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna remove edge. All right, so with those done, we're going to restart and uh, check it again. So it looks like pretty much the standard stuff. Um, we don't have any more Defender going on. Um, yeah, not too much going on. Looking a lot better now. So yeah, let's... Uh, Let's check Wireshark, we have a little bit. Um, so we have an Azure domain here, I'm not sure what that's for. Um, I'm assuming some other app that we have installed. Could be OneDrive. Yeah, probably. It's probably OneDrive, if I had to guess. Um, these are updates because we don't have that disabled. Um, all right, so now we will we'll do the the rest of the disabling and uninstalling, and uh, we'll check it one last time. All right, so now that we restarted and we fully cleaned up the system, we can uh, do one final check. So we'll have Wireshark open in the background. Apply DNS, and then we'll check process monitor. It should be fairly clean. Um, so yeah, mainly the service host, and yeah, some prefetch stuff. Pretty standard. 
but not nearly as much going on as you can tell. The events are, you know, climbing much slower now. So let's check. Uh, nothing going on in Wireshark. So we'll check uh, registry changes view. This should be really quiet now. So yeah, nothing going on. Nothing going on in here. So yeah, I'd say we got it down pretty clean. Um, obviously, if you open up like settings and stuff, you're gonna get some traffic as you can see. Same thing with um, stuff going on in the registry. As you can see, things are uh, logged. But yeah, um, in terms of just idling, this is pretty much as clean as you can get it for Windows 11.